Welcome back. Every Tuesday, our traffic expert Jason Luber tackles an issue that's been driving you mm -hmm. crazy. Jason, some good news. A troublesome bump on the yeah. Cherry Creek Dam Road is finally going away. And, and it's been there for a long time, and it's been an annoyance and quite a hazard. And I went out and visited actually last year. So let me get to the question. It's what's driving you crazy. The huge bump on the westbound lane of Cherry Creek Dam Road. This is where the concrete portion meets the asphalt. This is really bad in a car, but even worse on a motorcycle. Please get a hold of either Arapahoe County C or the city of Aurora to get this smoothed out. Well, I went out there when it was first reported to me last year to take a look at that bump for myself. And as like you said, it is significant. When I drove over it, the car rattled, jumped in the air just a little bit. I never saw a motorcycle ride over it, but I can imagine how unnerving it would have been. Traffic engineers tell me bumps like this easily develop where more rigid concrete meets pliable asphalt, especially with frequent temperature changes hmm. like around the dam. Now, the good news is that I received word last week that repairs were finally starting. And when I went out there again yesterday, I saw that bump being ground down, technically named the Crest Road at Cherry Creek Dam, but more commonly known as the Cherry Creek Dam Road. It's maintained by the U.S. Army Corps of Engineers, Omaha District, but Arapahoe County is facilitating this work that started yesterday. You see those trucks rolling through there right there. Now, the road's going to be closed down for 12 hours each weekday for a total of three weeks to complete these repairs and remove that bump that has been there for a couple of years, as well as remove that top layer of asphalt, as you can see the road miller out there right now then they will lay down the new asphalt surface the daytime closure runs monday through friday 6 a.m to 6 p.m through october 18th and the road will be open to traffic overnight like it is right now for the next oh about uh what 35 minutes or so mm -hmm. and then open on the weekends as well. Now over the next couple of weeks you can use I-225 or Parker Road as your alternates. You can use Yosemite and Hamden. Yeah. It's a little bit tricky. A lot of folks use it right by Cherry Creek High School right. as an alternate to some of those other roads uh. that get really packed in. Anyway, more details right now on the left side menu of Denver7.com. That's where you'll find Denver 7 traffic. Mm. I always love the view driving on this. Oh, it's so. beautiful. Yeah. Yes, of yeah. course. Yeah.